I started to get ready for this video at two o'clock in the afternoon and it's currently 10 o'clock. Procrastination at its finest right here. Hello folks and welcome to my channel. Today we're going to be doing uh, something a little different. A little different indeed. If you don't like body hair, this video is not for you. If it grosses you out, then you definitely need to leave because this is just a video solely about body hair and bedazzling it. So I got this brilliant idea, uh, not that long ago to dye my stomach hair. I dyed my hair green not that long ago and I was like, what the heck? I need matching green stomach hair. <laughs> I've dyed my armpit hair blue before, so what's the, you know, same thing, kind of? I am a very hairy little bean. I have a little pelt of hair everywhere. I'm like a human peach. I'm just like a just little, little peach fuzz, it's just everywhere. Like my entire body is just coated in it. A majority of it's blonde a majority, <laughs> which is nice. So you can't really tell. And usually I don't have a lot of it. I wax a lot of my hair off. So I don't have um, a lot of just my little hairs in general. But the last couple months, I haven't really done anything to my body because I've just been a mess and slacking on everything and I've let all of my hair grow to its full potential and <laughs> today I was like today's the day I'm gonna I'm gonna dye the stomach hair green now I don't know how well you can see it in this light but it's there by golly it's there I personally really enjoy my little stomach fuzz it's really soft and I like to play with it but I do get rid of it um for photo shoots and stuff like that because my little stomach is shown a lot and not everyone's into body hair and is comfortable and is cool with it as I am and when you model not every Everything is about what you like. It is what your people like and the people who get you to do stuff likes and yeah. Um, I usually don't have as much body hair as I have right now, but I have a lot at the moment. <laughs> I have no idea how well this is gonna work. We're just, we're, we're, we're winging it. Kind of, what kind of wing is this? You feel like if a bird does this, it would, it would fall and die a terrible death. Birds don't do this if you're watching this video. Fly like a normal bird. Oh my gosh, what am I doing? So I'm going to be using this dye um, to dye my stomach hair. And it is Iris Green by Arctic Fox. Um, that is also the current color I have on my head right now. And oh wow, how did I my nose itches? And I'm gonna be using a toothbrush to apply it. I found this toothbrush in my little toothbrush thing. There's a lot of hair on it. Uh, I don't know how old this is or who who it belongs to, but I hope they don't mind. See that? One of the dogs at the farm got a hold of this bad boy and started eating it and I was really sad and I cried about it um, because I spent too much money on this sports bra and I really want another one, but I just can't bring myself to spend another $30 on one, so I like to just wear it with the hole in it. One day I'll buy myself another one, but that day is is not soon. <laughs> Let's get down to business to dye the peach fuzz. Mix it up. Oh yeah, that's the stuff, folks. Oh wow, why did I do that? I have a feeling this is going to dye my stomach more than the hairs, but I'm hoping not. Uh, this dye usually does really well with not staining your skin too bad, so we'll see. Oh my goodness. Oh wow. <laughs> I really hope this works a little bit. Oh my God, can you see my little stomach hairs when I do that like that? I don't know if you guys can even see any of them at all. I really hope you can. Oh wow. Oh gosh, there's like dye in the little, the hole for my belly button ring. Oh my gosh. Oh, look at that. Oh baby. I really hope this works. It's gonna like awkwardly awkwardly laying back like this and wait this dye smells really nice too so that's a plus also i just want to say if you are a boy or a girl and you have a lot of body hair and you're struggling with uh accepting it there's nothing wrong with hair a lot of people have it i have it i have it everywhere i'm a fuzzy bean and it's okay if you want to keep your body hair there's nothing wrong with it if you want to get rid of it there's nothing wrong with that either 
It's whatever you feel comfortable with. It's your body and it's your little hairs and by golly, you do what you please with them. I mean, if you're gonna have it, I don't see why you shouldn't spruce it up and have fun with it. Like cut neat designs in it, dye it, put glitter in it, do all kinds of things. Or just don't do it and just have it if that's what you prefer, that's okay too. I personally have not seen anyone else dye their stomach hair before. I feel kind of cool to be the first person I've personally seen uh, do this. Okay, so it's been on for like five minutes. Ow. <laughs> you better believe if this works, I'm gonna be flaunting this everywhere. I read somewhere that if you do a little dance while you have dye in, it helps it set better because it connects with your body and it really forms and you become one with it. We're gonna give it a try. <laughs> Okay, I'm starting to sweat a little bit from the dancing, and I feel like that will probably um, not mix well with the dye, so we're, we're gonna stop. I think they've connected enough. I'm out of breath. <laughs> okay, my friends, it is time to rinse it off and see if it worked. Fingers crossed. Wait, okay, fingers crossed. <laughs> okay, here we go. I'm getting that belly button. Oh my gosh, I think it slightly worked. Very faint, but my stomach hairs are darker than they were before, so that means it did work a little bit. Okay, so it didn't work exactly how I was hoping it would, but I still can slightly tell a little bit, so I'm not, not happy about it. If I had more stomach hair, you'd be able to tell more. So in other words, I just need to grow more stomach hair. Oh my gosh, the more I look at it, the more you can tell though. <gasps> oh, this is exciting. I'm gonna try and take some pictures of it with my phone and see if I can really capture the greenness of my little belly hairs. <laughs> Maybe I just started a new trend. That would be really cool. Just a little disclaimer, this video was not sponsored. It'd be really cool if you guys did want to sponsor me because I use you all my hair and on my stomach hair too, not just this hair. <laughs> you know, if not, that's fine. That's, that's okay. Just throwing it out there. I would, I would, I would accept it. Just stay in. I really do recommend this hair dye though. Um, this is what I usually use when I have brightly colored hair. When I originally dyed it green, I used um, different dye and I wasn't very happy with it. So I went out and I picked this up. Um, I've always been happy with it. It is cruelty free and vegan and it lasts a super long time. Smells amazing. It's not like super harsh or anything. So <laughs> this hair sticking to my lip cloth. But yeah, definitely recommend this um, if you uh, dye your hair bright colors your head hair or, you know, stomach hair or armpit or butt hair, whatever hair you want to dye. This stuff's pretty good. I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video of me dyeing my stomach hair green. Just wanted to remind you that your body is awesome the way it is, whether it is super hairy or hair free. And either way, you should not feel ashamed about it because hair is a silly thing to be upset about. <laughs> That's the best way to end a video. Stomach hair right at you, just in your face. Mm. That dye made my stomach hair like extra soft. Oh wow. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, it is time to go. Hey, goodbye. <laughs>